somewhere. That was a dream. No, it was hell. my boyfriend to talk about the Lazarus effect with, so, with no makeup on. I don't have makeup on either. Yeah, so. we, we went all natural today. So, Lazarus effect. Did you like it? Yeah. Really? It, it's, a, again, a weird one because you like it more than I do. I liked it a lot. My expectations were low because... That's probably why. Mine were a little more... Yeah, I high. thought it was going to be just a boring movie and it had some twists and turns I wasn't expecting, so I was very excited. I guess so, that those were kind of interesting, but basically the general plot is that there's this group of um, people who got a grant to do this study to study um, or work on their project of bringing yeah. back the dead, so they would work on pigs and dogs and things like that. Well, it wasn't just bringing back the dead, it was like... Well, at first it was for coma patients, and yeah. then it the, was so they the doctors could work on them longer. They had more time, basically, to yeah. heal people. No spoilers. So. Sorry. Sorry about that. So somebody dies. They, they decide to stop experimenting on animals and to try and save, you know, the partner's lives. And then they do that. Then, you know, in the trailer you can tell they come back and then something's wrong with them. They start acting weird. And there was a lot more... Supernatural. Supernatural. There was a lot more supernatural elements than I was uh, expecting. Yeah, and I liked it, except I don't think it was really well executed at all. Like, the makeup and stuff was kind of cheesy, and a lot of the parts to me were cheesy. Like, nothing of it was really original, in my opinion. I thought it was cool, because a lot of it takes place in, like, one place, like the lab, and I thought that was interesting. We were kind of talking about, like, little things that are bothering us. There's a lot of, like, little things wrong with this movie. Yeah. That was weird because it seemed like things that you would spot in, like, a student film, but not really things that you would in see in a... such a professional. Yeah. Like, somebody was supposed to be dead, and both of us clearly saw that actor or actress breathing, and, like, yeah. that really bothered us. Yeah. It's just um, a lot of inconsistencies that were throughout the film and it's like did no one catch that when they were watching it yeah like the person couldn't hold their breath for five seconds while they get the shot like yeah, it wasn't it was, even a long take it was, was not just, a long shot they were breathing uh there's a part where this there's this scary noise scary noise but then we both start <laughs> laughing because it sounds like a fart oh man straight and up. so if you see that movie <laughs> I'm curious, did you recognize that fart noise? Because we both thought it was a fart noise. It was something else. And just little things like that. Uh... And there was like a point in the elevator where they were on opposite sides when they got in and then they were on opposite sides when they got out. Like, yeah, the actors really switched places. And you don't really walk around an elevator. Like when yeah. you enter, you come out the same side. I don't know. Which sounds nitpicky, but I mean, if it ruined... I mean, it didn't really ruin my experience, but it kind of... It affected it. Yeah. So... And there were things that were wrong with the movie. It wasn't mm -hmm. like things that affected our experience in a negative way that we just didn't like. It was just inconsistencies. Mm. As far as scares go, would you say it was more jump scares yeah. or psychological? Yeah, all or... the scares were jump scares, which they oh. made me jump. But I'm not a fan of jump scares. There's like, a you few guys good jump that. scares. There's a few good jump scares. Yeah, but they didn't no, even it out with scariness. Like, <laughs> I was actually thinking of the trailers we saw. I was thinking of the. Uh, the Insidious trailer. Oh. <laughs> the Insidious trailer has some good jump scares that we saw that looked really good, yeah. before we saw the movie. But you guys know I hate jump scares. Um, unless it's followed through with actual scare factor, like psychological or just like disturbingness, and that it didn't mm -hmm. follow through. It was like jump scares that weren't relevant. Yeah, I think most of it was a little bit jump scares, but I think they did have some cool kind of eerie the Definitely. movie had an eerie tone. Like, the girl, she acts like... She acts creepy. She starts, like, talking to people, and uh, she starts repeating as they're talking, and then they stop talking, and then she continues with what they were about to say. You know, I thought that was kind of creepy, and she has this weird look on her face as she's doing it, and, like, more things like that. 
uh, it's a creepo dog in there. There's yeah, a, the dog was really cool. There's a creepy dog in there. And see, it had those moments that were good, but they were more like cool or interesting than scary. You that's weren't true. like horrified, like or disturbed. Yeah. It was just like, oh wow, that's kind of creepy or that's cool. So that's probably why we differ, because you're probably expecting a good horror movie, mm -hmm. and it was just kind of like a neat movie. Yeah. And I was expecting a stupid movie. And overall, yeah, <laughs> that's it was. Why it was good for you. Yeah, overall, it was just kind of a neat little movie. Yeah, I mean, I, I would say watch it, but I wouldn't say you have to go to the theater and watch it because, I mean, I think it would still have the same effect if you watched it at home. It was cool, and it had good parts that I would recommend watching for those parts, but overall it wasn't what I expected and it wasn't as scary as I thought. Well, let us know down below if you saw it in theater. Let us know down below. <laughs> Sorry, my camera stopped recording. Let us know down below what you thought of this movie if you saw it and if you'd recommend it, or if it wasn't what you expected either. And I'm really curious uh, about that fart noise, so if you Leave notice if you notice the fart noise, just, just tell me if you notice the fart noise. So that is it. I hope you enjoy. Make sure to leave movie requests down below, and I will talk to you soon. Bye. You want to say bye? No. <laughs> Join us. <laughs> That's me. I'm your girl. I will do whatever it takes for this role.